Alrighty. So this is going to be a reading for my Sagittarius. Thank you so much for joining me here. This is going to be a look at the next 72 hours for you guys. So January 22nd through the 24th. So we're going to get straight into the reading. If you are new here, welcome. Make sure you subscribe and hit that notification bell. And if you would like to get a personal reading with me, check out the description box. That's where my website will be listed, okay? All right, Sagittarius for the next 72 hours. Let's see. Alrighty, so the overall energy is the Eight of Pentacles. Your current energy is the Temperance card. The challenge is the Page of Swords. Advice from Spirit is the King of Cups. And then the outcome is the Nine of Cups. Okay. Sagittarius for the next 72 hours. Okay. So we have a new romantic cycle begins. Okay. This energy looks good. Sagittarius for the next 72 hours. And we have protection. Alrighty, so first card we're going to start with is the Eight of Pentacles, representing the overall energy. So Eight of Pentacles is the energy of you guys really getting to work. So this could be um, you getting to work in terms of like taking up extra hours at your job. Or for some of you guys, you could be looking for like an extra job or an extra stream of income. Um, this is you guys... Staying focused if you have a business. This is also putting in that work when it comes to maintaining it um, and also finding like new ways to like take your business further. Hmm. This is also you possibly trying to put work into your marriage or your relationship and trying to pay attention more to what your person may be saying um, is the issue with the connection. And Eight of Pentacles, this is also the energy of some of you guys like working out, like getting back onto your like workout regimen or possibly even working on your overall health just in general. OK. Now, when it comes to your current energy, we do have you as the temperance card. So this is you guys standing in your power. You guys are the temperance card in the tarot deck. So you guys showed up in your own reading, honey. OK, um, but with the temperance card, this is you guys being in your element. This is you guys trying to take a more balanced approach. Also trying to get your own personal emotions in order here. This is also you guys taking everything day by day and also exercising a level of patience in the process of getting to where you need to be in your career or in life in general. Okay, this is you guys also trying to be overly patient with somebody romantic as well. Now, the challenge, I do have the Page of Swords, so this could be like a nagging Aquarius, Gemini, or Libra, okay, so an air sign. It, it also could be any sign, not just an air sign. And this could be a family member, girlfriend, boyfriend, boss, whoever, roommate. Um, also, there could just be somebody around you who may be trying to be intentionally petty towards you so be careful of engaging in that um especially if like you're you're not here for that <laughs> like avoid entertaining that energy because somebody is going to be intentionally petty towards you um for some of you also the challenge may be more of executing certain ideas that you have you may have certain things that you want to do or put in place but you may not know how to actually do so, or you may need some money to do so. Now, the advice from spirit is the king of cups. So this is you guys getting in touch with your own needs and wants. Also making sure you guys are working on being more emotionally available or making sure you're dealing with people who are emotionally available to avoid getting hurt or put into situations um, that don't pan out exactly the way that you would have hoped, you know? 
Hmm. Now, with the outcome, I do have the Nine of Cups. So this is talking about personal fulfillment. This is you guys being in a place to where emotionally you guys are really going to be pretty content in your own energy, especially if you are single. Um, but this is like self-fulfillment. This is you guys knowing what you want and going after it. Of course, there may be a piece of you that feels like emotionally something's missing. But for the most part, you guys are definitely going to be in an emotionally content place. Okay. Um, this could also be a good sign of like a, a wish coming true. So, okay. So looking further into this though, we do have a new romantic cycle begin. So this is a good sign for new romance. Um, this is also a sign of if you are in like an existing relationship, some changes coming. So this could be changes for the better or changes for the worse, depending on your situation. Okay. But there's definitely some sort of new cycle that's going to be starting. Um, and when we say new cycle, this is new wave of energy and all of those things. And then also with protection during this time frame, you guys are definitely being protected by your spirit guides when it comes to the moves that you're trying to make here. Um, they're really, they're really backing you guys. Um, and for a lot of you as well, this is making sure that you're investing in your own protection. If you are a woman watching this, um, or even a male, um, you, you have to invest in protecting yourself because there is crazy people out there. Okay. <laughs> But um, I'm going to stop right here. Thank you so much for watching this. I hope that you enjoyed this reading. If you did, thumbs up this video and make sure you subscribe. And yeah, all my information to reach me will be listed below and I will see you in the next one.